what was it? I used to hide in the beer box of PV liquor. Uh, it was about 40 something <clears throat> years ago. Did you know my dad used to have Playboys downstairs in the basement? No, I didn't. <laughs> I don't think he knew it either. <laughs> That's what I think. <laughs> Oh, boy, it comes out, you know. Uh, so here we are, limited series, August 2014, and our first wine is Bonarda. Uh, man, I opened this uh, two nights ago at the house, and it just landed here. So it just came from uh, Argentina, and so it was a little, you know, what happens when a wine gets shipped, it gets jostled around so much on the boat that it, it collapses it's on itself, and it takes a couple weeks for it to open up. And, and you can tell what it's going to be like if you open one of those wines and it's tight, and you let it open for about an hour if it just sits in the glass, and then you'll see what the wine's going to be like. And man, this was... This is a big wine. This, this is, is a, a really wine. big, big wine. Uh, you know, Bonarda is one of those grapes that they thought was Merlot in Bordeaux in France. And then when they found out it wasn't, they, they shipped it to Argentina. <laughs> Pretty crazy. It's, well, it's normally very acidic. It normally doesn't have nearly this extraction. Yeah. Like the mid-palate. And this is just going to grow. This has grow a this grow. has a nice char, a kind of a licorice to it. I mean, it it's really it's pretty damn it's amazing. Color too. I mean, it's yeah, really, it's really dark. dark. Black. I, I I loved it, and I loved it after it was in the glass for an hour. So if you get a chance, open it. I actually decanted it uh, the other night just to see what would happen to it, and it was just gorgeous. Same with, with the what? Twenty four ninety nine on the shelf. The reorder price is almost half that. Twelve ninety nine. Uh, killer wine for thirteen bucks. I'll tell you. That is really good. Mm hmm. Who priced that twelve ninety nine? I guess I did. Unfortunately, you did, and it's a little late and now. It's now. Pr now it's published. Yeah, and now you're. It's it's you history. You can sell this for sixteen dollars all day long. And that's no one that's bad true. Eilish. You know, often when I taste wines, um, sometimes the final analysis is: Would I sit with Ed at with with a, one of his sous vide recipes and drink this and enjoy it? That's really what the. That's question. what it's all about. Um, and I'm giving it a ninety six. I give it a ninety five, because if I wouldn't sit and drink it or serve it to Sandra as a wine for the evening, then I, that's the bottom line. If it's so interesting that you just, it's not enjoyable, I don't, I don't, I don't buy them. 